Welcome to this overview tutorial on JMOL application series. In this tutorial, we will go through important features of JMOL application, information regarding download and installation on various operating systems, uses of JMOL application. We will play clippings of video tutorials available in JMOL application series at our website. To follow this tutorial, you should have knowledge of high school chemistry or basic organic chemistry. To record this tutorial, I am using Ubuntu operating system version 12.10, JMOL version 14.1.11, Java version 7 and Mozilla Firefox browser 35.0. About JMOL application, JMOL is a molecular viewer for three-dimensional chemical structures and macromolecules. JMOL can be used to create and edit 3D models of chemical structures. This software can be used by students, educators and researchers in chemistry and biochemistry. Here are some important features of JMOL. It is a free and open source software. Works on Windows, Mac operating system, Linux and also on Android devices. It supports all major web browsers. No special hardware is required for high quality 3D rendering. Images can be exported to various file formats such as JPG, PNG, GIF, PDF, etc. Reads various file formats such as PDB, CIF, MOL, CML, XYZ, etc. If you are connected to internet, you can directly load models on JMOL panel from databases such as PubChem for chemical structures and PDB database for proteins and macromolecules. More information about this software is available at the following links. Uses of JMOL JMOL can be used as a teaching tool to explain concepts in chemistry and for producing high quality 3D images that can be used in print media such as journals, publications and books and also for presentations in classrooms and lectures. JMOL can also be used for molecular modeling and producing animation movies. Here is a web page that describes how to incorporate JMOL images in PowerPoint presentations. JMOL can be effectively used to teach certain topics in chemistry which require 3D visualization. At basic level, topics such as structure and functional groups, atomic and molecular orbitals. At advanced levels, JMOL can be used to teach topics such as stereochemistry which involves the study of spatial arrangement of atoms in a molecule, symmetry and point groups, crystal structure and unit cell and predict proton NMR spectrum for molecules. This feature is available in JMOL version 14.0 and above. JMOL can be used to study structure activity relationships. Let us see how to download and install JMOL. JMOL can be installed on Windows, Mac operating system and on Linux systems. A special version of JMOL for Android devices is available at the link shown below. For Linux operating systems, download using Ubuntu Software Center or Synaptic Package Manager. Follow this tutorial in the Linux series on our website. For Windows and Mac operating systems, open the given link in any web browser. I will open this link and quickly go through the contents given on the web page. This web page gives a lot of general information about JMOL. Scroll down the page. It gives information about the overview, demonstration pages, features. To download JMOL, click on the downloads page. Follow the instructions given on the page to download. Information about installing and running JMOL is also given on this page. I have created a series of tutorials which describe how to use this software. The first tutorial, Introduction to JMOL Application, has information 
regarding the various features available on JMOL window. Here is the video clipping of that video. Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial on introduction to JMOL application. To create and edit molecular models, follow the tutorial create and edit. Here is the clipping. Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial on create and edit molecular models in JMOL application. We can measure bond lengths, bond angles and dihedral angles. Here is the video clipping. Welcome to this tutorial on measurements and labeling in JMOL application. Using JMOL, we can show surfaces and create atomic and molecular orbitals. Here is the video clipping. Welcome to this tutorial on surfaces and orbitals in JMOL application. In this tutorial, this video explains how to show plane of symmetry and point groups. Here is the video clipping. Welcome to this tutorial on symmetry and point group in JMOL. In this tutorial, we will learn crystal structures and unit cell can also be viewed using JMOL. Here is the video clipping. Welcome to this tutorial on crystal structure and unit cell in JMOL. In this tutorial, we will learn Here is the video clipping to show proteins and macromolecules in JMOL. Welcome to this tutorial on proteins and macromolecules. In this tutorial, we will learn a simulated proton NMR spectrum can be displayed for all the molecules listed in chemical structure database, starting from JMOL version 14.0. Let me open JMOL window and demonstrate this feature. To view simulated proton NMR, go to Tools menu, scroll down to Spectra and click on Spectra. The JSpec view window opens. Scroll down the file menu. Click on Add Simulation. In the dialog box, enter the name of the molecule. Let us type nitrobenzene. Click on OK button. A proton NMR spectrum of nitrobenzene is displayed on the panel. Atoms on the structure are correlated with signals in the spectrum. Certain files include information about molecular vibrations such as gamma's dot log files and spartan output files we can open these files in jmol and view vibrations let me open a log file showing vibrations in carbon dioxide molecule here is the animation video showing vibrations in benzene molecule here is the animation video showing conformations in cyclohexane molecule. Let us summarize. In this tutorial, we have learnt important features of JMOL application, information regarding installation on various operating systems, uses of JMOL application. We have also seen clippings of video tutorials in JMOL application series and some animation videos showing vibrations and conformations of cyclohexane. The video at the following link summarizes the Spoken Tutorial project. Please download and watch it. The Spoken Tutorial project team conducts workshops and gives certificates for those who pass an online test. For more details, please write to us. Spoken Tutorial project is funded by NMEICT MHRD Government of India. More information on this mission is available at the link shown. This is Nehalata from IIT Bombay signing off. Thank you for joining.